There is no denying that sports have played a huge role in shaping America. And with Tampa Bay being such a sports town and a sports area, it makes perfect sense that a traveling Smithsonian exhibit called Hometown Teams would make a stop right here in the Bay Area. And that's where we find Brightside Sean Stryker this morning in Newport Richie. Sean, pretty cool. This is a Smithsonian exhibit, so it's got national, if not international connections, but it's also got some local connections as well. Yeah, and that's what's really neat about it. Each town it stops in adds their own personal touch. But this is a really hands-on exhibit. This is one of my favorite parts of the exhibit. You get the sights, the sounds, and even the smells of some of those ballparks around the country. Yeah, it smells just like popcorn. I mean, how cool is that? There's so much to do, so much to see here at the Hometown Teams exhibit. This is Casey. She's Hi, with the Sean. city of Newport, Richie. Good morning. How are you? I'm fabulous. Thank you for being here. Well, thanks for having me. All right, so like we were saying, this is a Smithsonian traveling exhibit, so it's a really big deal that it's here in Newport, Richie. It sure is. Okay, there's only five cities in the entire state of Florida that get to have this museum here, and we are the first one on the stop, so I'm really excited. So tell me a little bit about it. I mean, how does it work? Okay, well, you first you come on in, and it's totally free, so all you have to do is sign in so we can keep track of the number of visitors. Then you grab yourself a sports card, and what you do is you walk through the exhibit, you find the little sports tags, and you answer the questions, and you play the games, and you listen to what's going on. You have a great time. And what we were saying a little earlier, and what, one of my favorite things is you kind of add your own personal touch to the exhibit, yes. uh, that, uh, that Newport Richie touch, and there's like a whole room dedicated over here to... The high school. There sure is. Well, come and on, let me show you guys. Come on in here. Golf High School. Golf um, High School alumni room. And this is so cool. You can come in here, see some pictures of some. Uh, you have the mayor. You have different uh, city council city people. council members. Yes, we do. Uh, there's a really neat thing. I didn't know that there was a minor league baseball team here in Newport Richie called the Plutocrats. Yes, in the 1930s and 40s. And there's some pictures you get to see that. But, you, you know, I love the old artifacts. And this says, please don't touch. <laughs> um, I'm going to have to ignore it. I'm sorry. Because this is what I love putting on the mascot heads, Rob. You can come out here. You can check it out. Hometown Team Exhibits. It's open Wednesday through Saturday, completely free to come out with your family. Yeah. And, uh, it is, really. It's a lot of fun. Sean, pretty cool. They're the pirates now. That's not the plutocrat mascot right there. Um, Sean, by the way, you were talking about the uh, smell of the ballpark. What, what do you mean? You just, like, lift something up and you smell it, and it tells you what the ballpark smells like? You, you squeeze that little bottle, and uh, the smell of popcorn comes out. It's, uh, it's pretty neat how they do it. That's unique. All right, there it is, folks. Uh, Jose Gasparilla right there having a great time in Port Ritchie for us this morning. Thank you, Sean.